All right, this is Andrew with Joda Home Inspections. We're here in Salt Lake doing a sewer scope. Today is October 20th, 2022. And we're at 1951 Garfield Ave. We've got the camera pushed out 111 feet to the city connection. That's what you're seeing on the screen now, it's the city line. Now we're gonna pull it back and record it and see what we find. So this first connection point is called the nose on. That's where it goes from your lateral line into the main city line. So this looks like cast iron. Um, so the original line. The issue with cast iron is it gets very rough and rusty. Uh, that's what you're seeing on the screen now. As it rusts, it makes it a lot easier for waste to get stuck, which can create blockages and lead to backups. I would certainly recommend getting the insurance on this line. I used to always recommend HomeServe, but I've been hearing some mixed reviews about them now. And so I would see if your homeowners covers it, or not, they won't cover it, but if they have a, an additional policy you can get just for the sewer line. That way it'll offset it if it has a backup, uh, or if and when it needs to be replaced. Uh, eventually cast iron will need to be replaced as it thins out and gets rough. Cast iron is easier to collapse. It's also very hard to inspect in some ways because a lot of that rust can cover up cracks. And so there's a lot that we can see. We can look at the grade. Uh, this one's looking good where it's not holding water. That indicates proper grade. I'm not seeing any waste stuck in the line, which is good. And so it's it's not having any issues today. It's just old um, and more prone to have issues because it's rough and rusty. Uh, no roots, which is good. When you have roots, that gives it another spot that's easier for waste to get stuck. I'm accessing the line through the roof stack. You'll notice in just a second it's going to turn right there. And now we're coming up the stack. So just to recap, you have cast iron going all the way out. Uh, it does appear to have proper grade because it wasn't holding any water. But it is uh, um, original cast iron. It looks pretty rough average for the age, but I've definitely seen a lot of houses of this age that have already had it replaced. Um, the other option, when it is time to replace it, or if you choose to do it proactively, is to have a liner put in. A liner is nice because they don't have to dig up the entire line. They just shoot a liner in. Sometimes they do have to dig up a couple spots to put it in, but they blow a liner through the line and then harden it and it's kind of like having a new pipe inside of the old pipe. Um, liners work great as long as you have proper grade, which this one does. So I'm going to end this recording now.